Welcome back. In this session, we're going to be learning how to move our part to the origin point, as well as opening up a document and saving a document as well. So we'll go ahead and get started by opening up our last exercise. So go up to the menu, File, and Open. And our part's going to be a .emcx file. So those are the only parts that you'll be able to view. So if you click on it, and if you actually come up here to the right and click Preview, you'll be able to see the part. Now you, won't, you may not be able to see that entire part depending how you saved it, but you'll be able to see a preview of the part. And then we'll come up here to the check mark button and click on the check mark, and there's our part. So in that preview, you really saw from this point right here to this middle of the circle. That's why it did not look like our entire part. So now what I want to do is I want to move our entire part to the origin. So I want to move this corner, let's say, to the origin point. So I'm going to go up here to Option, Move to Origin, and I'm going to come down here and click on the bottom left corner. And you're going to see that move to the origin. So now I'm going to go up here and click on Clear Colors, and this will clear any highlighted colors. So now I'm going to come over here and click on Fit, so I can see it throughout an entire graphical area. And there you go. Now we have our part according to the origin. So now I'm going to go ahead and save my part, click on File, Save As. And then I'm just going to go ahead and override my part since I saved it before. And click on the check mark button. Or you can type in any name that you like under file name. And click on the check mark button which is save. And it's going to ask me to replace it. I'm going to click on yes. And there you go. This concludes our session.